To me, leadership means two things. It means inspiration and it means responsibility. Uh, inspiration of everybody within the organization is, is a key role for any leader. Within ours, it's very challenging because uh, we're a global architectural practice and so managing and leading a group of highly creative, highly talented, energetic, enthusiastic individuals uh, presents many, many, many challenges. The goal has to be creating a structure in an organization that will allow them to provide the best service to our clients, to, to contribute to the vision and the goals and the strategy of the firm as, as we continue to grow, uh, but also for them to realize their individual potential in, in whatever endeavor it is they undertake within the firm. Responsibility is, is the important part of leadership, and, and one of the key issues that we see right now is the leadership that we can contribute in the world in terms of environmental responsibility. We know right now that up to 50% of total fossil fuel energy consumption and greenhouse gas emissions are, are the direct result of buildings, either in their construction or in their ongoing operation. Uh, we think that it's, it's not only a, a necessity, it's a moral responsibility to provide leadership, to work with our clients around the world to help create buildings in cities that are more environmentally and socially responsible and to make some, some fundamental changes in the way we create our built environment. What I think is really interesting about a leadership role at this time as a Canadian uh, working on the international stage is the unique, uh, the unique abilities and background and exposure we have in Canada. Our ability in our multicultural society to understand, to appreciate other cultures, to both contribute and to learn from them, I think uniquely positions Canadians in a leadership role in the world today, uh, particularly in the professional and, and uh, knowledge uh, services industries.